welcome back so today I'm going to be showing you my Bath and Body Works haul for SAS some of you guys have really been wanting to see this and to be quite honest I really wasn't planning on doing one this time because I didn't do too much shopping however I have bought some things it just didn't feel like I bought a lot at one time so if you guys are interested definitely stick around here um, I got this brush for 75% off I think it was about three dollars and guys I have been eyeing this for so long but I would never pay the I think it's like $14 yet this was $14.50 and no I just couldn't ever see myself purchasing this for $14.50 so um, when I saw it on the sale for 75% off, I could not resist it. And so yeah, it just looks like this. It has a marble detail in here with the pink little handle here. And I just think it's so cute. Vanilla comb, and this is just a hand sanitizer. I actually do like the smell of this, but I don't particularly care for the consistency of this sanitizer because it takes a really long time to um, absorb into your skin. It is really moisturizing. So if you're somebody that needs to like lotion up or something like this, I think this will work just as good as maybe putting on lotion and having the additional benefit of sanitizing your hands. So yeah, I picked this up as well as these were back at the register for $2.50. So I picked one of these up this time. And this one is a cute unicorn one. I don't know if you can see this but it's a cute unicorn one and it is in the fragrance honeysuckle these are super easy for spraying up the kids hands when we are on the go so I really do like to have these if I go back to the store which I am because I have some returns um, I am going to pick up at least another one of these because they are only around during semi-annual sales and I really do like these for the kids things I got were just these 75% off makeup brushes right here and I got these for like a dollar and some change on the first day of the sale I couldn't resist getting two of these I'll probably give one away to somebody else probably like my sister or something and um yeah just got two of these okay so the next thing I picked up was this here and this is the sweet almond and honey sweet almond sweet almond and honey was not on 75% clearance when I purchased it but I really did want this fragrance I have been looking at it for such a long time and honestly I don't know why it took me to semi annual sale to purchase it because I really do love it and I kind of regret not being able to pick up the entire fragrance line from this set but at least I got the fragrance mist so I'm happy about that and these aromatherapies I'm already using one of these and these were 75% off these smell so good um yeah even like if you have a husband or a son or something these will work for them too it's not very feminine at all it is eucalyptus and basil and so I did wind up picking up three of these and guys I really do like to have the eucalyptus bath gel and products for when I'm not feeling so well so I did go ahead and pick up the eucalyptus and this really is nice it's really um medicinal that's the word so I picked two of these up and um, I think one's in my shower already but yeah I picked up two of these I also picked up the pillow mist in this as well as this three-in-one oil here I do have kids and I am sick quite frequently guys so I you know I just like to keep this on hand for myself because I have the four-year-old and my nine-year-old is not as bad as she used to be but she still can bring home a doozy of a cold every now and then so yeah I did pick these up for 75% off guys I found some scrubs ah, I love me some scrubs and whenever I can find them for 75% off I always try to get at least two of them now these still worked out to be about four dollars but still from sixteen dollars to four you cannot beat that deal and so I got the orange ginger and then I also got the lavender and cedarwood and so the next couple of items are all for my daughter as I said I have a nine-year-old daughter and she's going to the fourth grade and she's starting to get into you know the smell goods and things like that I'm trying to get her into wearing deodorant every day and you know girls just being a girl and having pride in yourself so I did pick her up a couple of products so she got the watermelon lemonade right here which she loves she has used the lotion but she's never had her own spray so I got her the entire line I got her the body wash 
um, the which one is this this is the ultra 24 hour moisture right here and then I got her just the lotion here so I had her I got her the whole set and these were 75% off if I'm not mistaken yeah these were 75% off so yeah I picked up her a shimmer mist now I was not planning on buying this but my sales associate who my sales associates I love them so much they all know me when I go in there because I'm just in there too much um but she picked um this up and said you know what these are 75% off and my daughter's like oh a sparkle <laughs> you know a sparkly one um diamond mist or whatever these are called I don't know but you know she loves a sparkle she's a little girl so and this does smell good it's the peach I'm not particularly a peach girl but this really does smell nice um so yeah I picked it up for her and this is the pretty as a peach and the diamond shimmer mist and again it has a nice little shimmer to it she's gonna enjoy it so why not some more of these pocket bags I just been let me just I just been going pocket bag crazy lately I don't know why but I feel like I just needed some so I let my kids pick some out and my son picked up the juicy watermelon my daughter picked up one of these little what is this one called I don't even know a thousand wishes we have a couple of thousand wishes not that I like it but she likes the name a thousand wishes um and then um we got twerkers waters this is a cute little mermaid one and then we got girls support girls and this is in a cherry chill and then I got the very galactic swirl this was my daughter's it has a little mermaid on it and then my son got the cosmic clean and it's so funny how they pick out um, their own and I didn't even tell him you know that this was kind of like a dude scent but it yeah it was it's appropriate for a little boy although he's four and I would never just let him have one of these on his own but so yeah and then the last one is this magical mango so yeah a bunch of packet bags this time um did pick up a couple of their hand soaps but I didn't find any 75% off hand soaps which is usually my goal during semi annual sale but these were only half off so I only picked up three of these I picked up three for myself and three for my mother um, she already has hers but then I picked up the blueberry crumble and it looks like this this is really a beautiful scent I have a couple of these and I really like this so my husband loves it and so I said why not because I don't know if they're gonna bring this out again so I picked up blueberry crumble and then my beloved pink petal tea cake I picked up two more of these so I have a total of I think four of these now so yeah had to pick these up is the thing that well this is the portion that I was most excited about during the semi-annual sale which is kind of odd for me because like I said I usually go for the hand soaps but this time I was all about them candles so I bought a lot of candles this time and if you guys want to see this let me just say um I have I think like 10 candles um this bag is actually candles that didn't work out for me and i'm going to be taking back to the store but i don't know when i'm going to go in i'm not going to rush myself to go back it might be this week it might be next week um so yeah i'm just gonna go when i don't have my kids with me so like i said i don't know when that's gonna be but let me get these out and then i'm gonna show you this one that i picked up that remember these are gonna go back but i picked up the island papaya and my daughter picked this out and i do like it however i feel like it's a scent that i've had before and that i've burned and wasn't that impressed with in my home so i think i'm gonna return this and get something different um this one says tropical coconut fresh papaya sugar cane and essential oils and yeah i'm kind of just like kind of over that coconutty type scent i have so many coconut candles to get through already and so even though this one is super cute and the scent is nice i think i'm gonna go for something that i really do love so this one is going to be going back picked up the salted pretzel milkshake now i like this scent on cold and i don't know i'm on the fence about it when it's burning but my husband he says it smells like Chinese food <laughs> so I don't want my house to smell like Chinese food and so 
yeah this gotta go back unfortunately it was not a winner for me i wish it had been a little bit sweeter um but yeah this one i didn't burn i bought three of these hoping that i would love it but no it's a no-go no chinese food smell in my house <laughs> You will not believe the candle that I picked up. Oh my God. I picked up the Rome candle. The Pizzeria. No. This one I never liked um, when I smelled it in the store. I didn't like this one. I did have my children with me. And they loved it. They love this candle. And then the sales associate. She's like, oh, well, you should get it and tell us how it burns. And, but girl, I don't think I can light this in my house. I just don't think I can do it. So this has got to go back to the store and I'm going to get something else. Um, yeah, the key is just going to have to deal with that. I just can't. Uh, it is so dead on. They got the scent so dead on. But baby, uh-uh. Not pizza dough. This one is fresh garden basil, tomato sauce. Warm, crusty pizza dough and essential oils. <laughs> essential oils with pizza dough. <laughs> but okay, guys. So, yeah, no. Um, this will be going back. So, I was lucky enough to score a couple of 75% off candles. And so, yeah. Let me just show you these now. This happened on the first day of the sale. Um, so, yeah. I did go in about 9 o'clock that morning. And then I went to a couple stores. I went to like three day, um, three stores on the first day of the sale. So, I was shopping around that day. Um, but yeah. Let me just tell you what this one is. This one is holiday. And it just smells like cinnamon um kind of like big red gum i've never had this one or anything well i've had tis the season but i don't think it kind of don't smell like tis the season it's a little bit different it says made with nutmeg and clove essential oils with notes of cinnamon and cardamom and so this one was like my most favorite 75 percent off candle that i have found I found the pistachio ice cream for 75% off. Here it is. So yeah, this one is nice. I bought this one during the candle day sale in December. And so yeah, I knew that I liked it. So I went ahead and scooped it up. It's just roasted pistachio, almond extract, and vanilla extract. This one is so nice. I have not yet burned this one. But I think I'm going to burn it this summer. Ah, so nice. So happy I found this for 75% off. So yeah, this worked out to be like $5 for this candle. So super happy to find this. The chestnut and clove candle for 75% for off. So yeah, um, this is a nice manly scent, but it's kind of like Christmas tree mixed in with it. I like it. I think during the winter time, when it's cold, I like to like stuff like this, like in our movie room and, you know, just snuggling up with my hubby during, you know, movie night or whatever. Oh, I love it. It's so nice. It's like just a cozy scent. Just, oh, I can't wait for Christmas now. <laughs> so it says warm roasted chestnut, fresh ground clove, and cedarwood. So, yeah. Mmm, I love this. This is good. I can't wait for Christmas. Okay, so the next things that I picked up are just the candles when they were at that $10 price point. I don't think that they're running that sale right now. If they are, great. I might actually pick up some more. Um, <laughs> even though I don't need to. But, um, I bought the berry waffle comb. I actually bought three of these. Burnt one and gave one away to my niece for her birthday. This one is so nice. Oh, yeah. I love this one. I had it when it was in the rib packaging. Um, I was lucky enough to find one at 75% off. And, um, yeah. Loved it. And I'm so glad they brought it back this year. I really do love the packaging this year. Which is why I think I might need at least one more. Because this packaging is so cute to me. I love it. Ugh. And the scent is gorgeous. Um, it says sweet summer berry, golden waffle cone, creamy vanilla, and essential oils. And this is a nice, beautiful scent. It's a pretty strong thrower too. So yeah, I just really like this one. So if you see this one and you haven't tried it yet, definitely give this one a try. I 
I picked up is this one and this is the Sunlit Cashmere and it looks like this. I'm kind of on the fence about the packaging on this one. It's not one that I would have gravitated to normally but I do enjoy the scent. I had this in a wallflower and it had my bedroom smelling so amazing that I had to pick this one up and this of course would be for my bedroom. It's just a nice clean scent. I love it. It's so nice. Yeah. So the note 3 Moroccan Jasmine Creamy Coconut Orange Flower Blossom candle that I picked up is an oldie but goodie. It is the Summer Boardwalk candle and it looks like this. I love the packaging on this one. It is so cute to me. So of course I had to pick up Summer Boardwalk. Oh yeah. It's like popcorn, apples. <laughs> I know popcorn sounds fun, kind of funny but it works. Popcorn, apples, caramel. It's just nice. It says caramel glazed popcorn, warm taffy apples. I can't talk. Warm taffy apples, salty sweet cream, and essential oils. Mmm. It's so good, you guys. This one is a staple for summer for me. I usually go through one of these at least at the in August. I'll burn one of these. I have to confess, I have burned one of these already this summer. So yeah. And if you don't know, this is one of the strongest, if not the strongest, Bath & Body Works candle that you will find. So if you like a strong thrower, this is definitely one that you will want to pick up. Um, people will say they have to open up a window. All that jazz is too strong. They have to blow it out. I don't really have that problem with it, although I will have a window open if, you know, weather permitting. Um, so yeah, I do love this one nonetheless, though. Such a good candle candle that I picked up is this Seattle one here and this one is the white caramel cold brew now I didn't pick this up during that first sweet shop collection that was out you guys I don't really follow the collections that much anymore but I just know I like what I like and I go in there and buy small amounts but sometimes it just happens like this okay <laughs> I'm just rambling Anyway, so this is a really nice caramel coffee type scent. I don't really get coffee in this to me. I mean, it might be like a slight hint of coffee, but not really. It's really nice though. Um, it says cold brew coffee, vanilla sweet cream, warm vanilla drizzle, and essential oils. So yeah, and it looks again like this. It, Oh, I just noticed my packaging is like splitting on here. I think it might get like, you know how like when they open the uh, boxes and maybe the knife probably hit it. But yeah, that's a bummer. Anyway, I'm not going to return it though. I'm going to keep So guys, that was it for my Bath and Body Works haul. If you guys would like to stick around, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, if not, I will see you guys in the next video. I'm going to go right ahead into my Victoria's Secret haul because I didn't get too much from that store at all. Most of the things that I picked up from that sale, I actually gifted to my niece. So yeah, I'm just going to jump right in and show you guys what I picked up from Victoria's Secret. I picked up a couple of their fragrances this time. I picked up the Good Vibes and... I really do like this one. This one is very nice. Um, it says lilies. It says fragrant lilies, pineapple breeze, pink sunset, and love yourself. Okay. All right. This one is very, very nice. Um, I wish I was able to find the entire set in this. Um, although they don't make body washes in these anymore. Um, but I wasn't. I only found the spray for myself. I found the set for my niece. Um, but yeah, I, you know, I wanted her to have it and so I picked her up the mist and the lotion and I just got myself this. And as you can see, I've been using this one. So yeah, this is nice for summer. Very, very nice. If you see it, grab it. Um, I picked up the purple haze. Honestly, don't know what this smells like. Uh, I don't know. Okay. I know why I picked it up. It says Marshmallow and Tiger Orchid. So this was intriguing to me because it has that sweet plus the floral. And so I feel like this will be good. But I don't want to open it until I'm ready to use it. Because 
I don't want it to start going bad on me. I do have so many to go through. So if I don't get it to it this summer, at least like the air won't get to it. Um, and I might be able to use it like next summer. So yeah, I got that. Three of these bubble washes for my kids. Guys, if you guys have kids and you see these, grab these because this will get them in the tub, in the shower, whatever. So, and this is, um, it's just a coconut oil. It says gel to foam. Now, I will say, my kids really do like the foaming ones better than the gel to foam. But they still like playing with this thing too. So, yeah, like I said, I picked up three of these and yeah. Okay, so the next couple things that I picked up are for my daughter. Um, she got the Urban Bouquets and this is another Shimmer Mist that she picked up. And it says Pedal to the Metal. I don't see any notes on here. Let me see. She's already sprayed it, so I'm going to go ahead and just give it a sniff and see what it smells like. Actually, it's more like a cleaner scent than a uh, fruity or floral if I can let it dry yeah it's like it's really nice it's cleaner it does have a bubblegum type scent to it to me but it's really nice I will wear this myself actually <laughs> but no I'm gonna let her have it um it has the shimmer in it but it's not too shimmery so if you are a grown-up this wouldn't look inappropriate for you at all um, yeah, it's really pretty. I love this um, iridescence that it has to it. But she saw I wanted it, and so there you go. So, yeah, she got that. And then she got the Unicorn Glow, and this is a shimmering body scrub. Um, I hope it has some bubbling action to it. I'm not going to open it because, again, it is hers, and I want her to be able to open her own scrub. Um yeah so that's that it's the unicorn glow and i only found the one otherwise i would have got two of these because i think the packaging is super cute in this but yeah i got that two bras and they just look like this um i got two in the this kind of action here and again this is a 34 b i have little ones <laughs> so yeah um this one is just in the victoria um, print here. I thought this one's cute so I picked this up and I picked it up for 19 but I was able to go back and get a price adjustment and then I picked up this one here and it's the same exact style. It doesn't have that underwire. These are just everyday bras and um, I love the straps on these. These are super comfortable. So yeah, I so guys, as you can see, I did not pick up a lot of stuff from the semi-annual sales this time. Not like, this is my pile, you guys. I usually have so much stuff. Um, but again, I gave a lot of stuff away. Um, I just tried not to go too crazy. I wanted to use up some of the things that I already have. And yeah, I know that I'm going to be back in there for candles, although I'm trying to stay out of there until candle day because that is my day you know you know what I'm saying you guys that's my day um for some of you you probably think I'm nuts <laughs> and this is like a ton of stuff but I know my BBW lovers you guys know and you understand how it is the obsession is real um so yeah guys thank you so much for hanging out with me today I really do appreciate you watching and I will see you guys in the next video Bye, guys.